Hi, I'm Pete Fairley with the Pro Football Hall of Fame. I'm here with Hall of Famer Chris Dolman. And Chris, in town to get prepared for what's coming your way in August. It's now been a little over a month since you mm -hmm. were in your hometown of Indianapolis, surrounded by family, watching on TV when you heard your name called for the Hall of Fame. How has your life changed since that day? Well, I've been pretty busy. Uh, first of all, I want to thank you for having me on the show. It's, uh, it's been an amazing experience. You know, people tell you that um, you'll, uh, you'll be overwhelmed. You'll be uh, just not prepared for all the things that are going to happen. And uh, they were absolutely right. I mean, there's a lot of stuff coming at me right now. It seems like your legacy for the game are your sacks. Mm -hmm. After all, 150.5. Mm -hmm. career sacks, eight seasons with 10 or more sacks. Are you comfortable with that or would you like to be known for leaving your impact on the game for something well, more than that? You know, I, I like the, um, I, I would like to think of myself as a, you know, all around player, not just someone who was great at rushing the passer. But, uh, you know, they measure defense alignment by how many sacks that they get, just like they measure, you know, baseball player by how many home runs he hits or RBIs. So, I mean, it's a, it's a statistic that stays with you. I'm glad that, um, you know, that I'm a part of uh, the Pro Football Hall of Fame. I'm, I'm, I'm proud to, to be able to post the numbers that I posted. And, uh, you know, if that's how they remember me, you know, so be it. They can always come here and find a little bit more about me. <laughs> so you had a chance to go through the Hall of Fame today. You're getting ready August 4th mm -hmm. to be enshrined. Have you started on your speech yet? Uh, yeah, I've just been practicing it the uh, last couple of days. I mean, just been talking a lot to people and getting a feel of what it feels like to speak back and forth to each other. And uh, no, of course, <laughs> I haven't started that. Okay. I haven't started that. It's just one of those things where that I think as you get closer to the game, you'll start or uh, to the event, you'll start breaking things down and start saying, okay, how do I want to formulate what I really want to say to everyone who's out there? We'll find out on Saturday, August 4th, as Chris Dolman and the rest of the class of 2012 gets enshrined into the Pro Football Hall of Fame.